Hello, hello, hello. Jason here with you. Guess what? I just finished vi filming a video on Unsettled and I said, I will see you tomorrow. But nope, it's still March 7th because I just got an information in my mailbox that went into my head and blew my head off. Guess what? Game found just announced. Sleeping Gods, Distant Skies, the standalone. Can you read it right there? The standalone, say it with me. Sequel to Sleeping Gods. I love Sleeping Gods. It's been such a fun game. Unfortunately, I haven't finished it yet. I haven't even finished it one time through. The life of a busy human being with kids and content creation and all the super fun things that life brings at you. We haven't finished it yet, but we love it. And this makes me excited. And you know one of the things I like about seeing uh, sequels like this? It's like Frosthaven, right? You see Frosthaven. I'm going to invest a hundred bucks in Frosthaven, which was really cheap back then. If you think about it, he still hasn't come here, by the way. And you're thinking that got, that's going to get me to finish Gloomhaven. And it kind of does. It gets you going on the old game before the new one comes, which it has done. So just thinking about this makes me go, let's bring out Sleeping Gods, get it done because I don't want to invest a penny in Ryan Lockett's Distant Skies until I have finished the first one. So I am seeing this for the first time, March 7th 2022 quick little video me saying hi to you let's have a conversation what do you think of this we you sleeping gods thing let's see project well the opening project goes straight to some comments diehard fans okay so they're not giving us much information in fact none but we do know this wait they're giving us 41 days so that's going to be may somewhere in there um middle of may may uh, middle of april middle of april Wow, surprise. Did anyone know this was coming? I had never heard it. Comments. There's some comments. How about some FAQs? None yet. Some updates. None yet. All we know is this. So let's read this together and then I'll let you go for the rest of the day. San Francisco, 1937. Your cargo plane flies through a portal in the sky, transporting you to a rugged landscape filled with bizarre creatures, scheming gods, and untold dangers. This time you're in a plane. This is great. But can you find your way back before the portal closes? Sleeping Gods, Distant Skies is a standalone sequel set in the world of Sleeping Gods. Adventure through a vast land as you read branching storylines, experience a thrilling tale that hinges on your choices. Boom. Okay. Ryan, Mr. Lockett, you live down here. You live in Utah with me. And in fact, I think Red Raven Games had a presence at SaltCon, uh, which I did. Maybe they weren't announced Distant Skies there. I didn't see it. Here, let me give you some advice. I'm honest about this and I want you to listen. I want you to listen. I know you're the genius. I know you're the genius and that you know better. Listen to me though. Less characters, less characters. There were too many. Man, if you could bring it down to one, if you could bring it down to one, one character per person, just, or one. I'm on it, it doesn't have to be solo. Could be two people in the plane, could be one, could be three. Scale that game so it just works. One problem, Sleeping Gods. I just want, and one of the reasons why it hasn't been finished, like Ryan, I'm talking to you. Too many characters. Everyone said it. Cut it down. Right? I don't even want to run two. I want to run one. If I'm soloing, if I'm with my wife, she's got one, I got one. Let's do it. It's such a beautiful world. I want to explore it. I don't want to spend all my time taking care of all these characters. I don't. Please don't make me do it. I don't think anyone else wants to do it either. If you're hearing the whole zeitgeist of the culture, no one else wants to either. They want less characters. They want to run their character. They want to love their character, get to know their character, and they want to succeed in this beautiful story. They want to explore the magical world that you and your wife and your team have created. So I know you can tell me to go to hell if you want. <laughs> you're the game, you're in charge, it's your game, it's your freedom. I just gave you my two cents, which you didn't ask for, I know. So I hope you forgive me. And I also hope, uh, I hope you do what you need to do. You're the artist and so I trust you. Go your way. You know what I prefer, but it's your game, it's your world, and I support you in it. Love you, brother. Love you people out there. Tell me what you think. Get down there tapping. I'd love to hear what you think about Sleeping Gods. Was it a game you liked, not liked? And what do you think about Distant Skies? And what do you think about the topic I just brought up, less characters? I would love to hear from you guys.